What does your peace of mind have to do with the way you eat? Well, I'll be answering that question tomorrow. Hey everybody, Sharon here, Integrative Nutrition Health Coach, speaker, teacher, and author of the Wellness Purpose Connection. And I am back today to give you some information. Tomorrow, I'm so excited to say that I will be on a radio program. It's called Intentional Spirit, and it's hosted by Temple Hayes of the Unity Church. So tomorrow I'll be on, and tomorrow is November 8th of 2017, and the program is at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. It'll be on the radio on Unity, Unity FM. So if you go to unity.fm, you'll be able to listen live at 2 p.m. It'll also be um, filming live on her Facebook page, uh, Temple Hayes, T-E-M-P-L-E-H-A-Y-E-S. What I'll do, since I spelled everything out there for you, is I'll also post the links to be able to listen to the program. We're going to be talking about what your peace of mind has to do with the way you eat. We'll also be connecting the spiritual component to the way we eat. You know, oftentimes we want to do better. We want to eat better. We know what to do. Goodness knows there's enough information out there telling us what to do. But for some reason, we just can't seem to, you know, get our act together the way we want to. Either we allow time to be, you know, the reason why or our jobs or, you know, just different demands on our life. When really what's happening is there's something happening underneath and it has to connect to our peace of mind and our spirituality. So we're going to talk about that tomorrow and how that all connects Again, Wednesday, November 8th, 2017 at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. I will post the links below. Go ahead and leave me a comment. Um, let me know if you're going to be watching or listening tomorrow. I would love for you to be there so I can share this wonderful information with you. And please like and like I say in most videos, go ahead and share the love. If I have been a blessing to you, please be a blessing to someone else. Well, I hope your day has been marvelously grand and I will see you tomorrow.